today is really a beautiful day it's right now 66 degrees it's sunny i'm loving it I'm all set. I'm going to Arlington, 109 Arlington, to drop off this load. And then from there, I have a pickup out of DeSoto Walmart coming back here. So let's get going. So this place here, I don't know if it's our yard. Or, I don't think it's ours, but it's a dedicated account anyway. Because I see final mile trucks and this year's trucks. But I know that the times I've delivered here, I've been delivering Ross, uh, the Ross loads. So it's a Ross account. just came here to pick up an empty that place didn't have an empty so I'm, go I'm here to pick up an empty and then I'm gonna go to DeSoto pick up a load that heads back to Hazlitt
right here in Desoto, Walmart Desoto. The last time I made a video showing you how to make uh, eggs in the microwave, but I was talking about fried eggs. Well, Thomas told me that you could also boil an egg in the microwave. And so he shared with me how to do it and I gave it a try. It's my first time doing it, so let's go. He said you get foil and then you put the egg in the foil. So I'm gonna wrap this in here. When he said that you put the egg in the foil, the first reaction was like, no, that can't be it. But then when, when I saw that you put it in a microwave bowl and then submerge it in water, I'm like, well, maybe that can work. So I'm gonna, this is the egg bowl. I'm gonna submerge it in water. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you right now, this looks tricky because I thought the egg would be able to stay down so that the water covers the, uh, the foil. But I don't know, maybe because of the foil, it's kind of floating, it's not really submerged. So I kind of feel scared putting it in there, but I wanna give it a try. He said about three to five minutes. This is kind of scary. I'm just going to start it, but I have my hand on here so that if I hear any sound, just click it open. Looks like it's working. All right, so it's time to find out if this thing is ready. It's been five minutes. He said three to five minutes. I decided to go with five minutes just to make sure it's ready. So honestly speaking, I'm afraid of breaking it because I feel like it, it would have been more than five minutes. It doesn't feel like it's, it's hard. Um, but let, let's see. That didn't work, it's still raw. Which means uh, probably it has to be more than five, uh, five minutes because five minutes didn't work. So I'm gonna try it again and put in more than five minutes. Alright, so it turns out the experiment does work. It does work, you can put, um, you can boil an egg in the microwave. I think the reason why it didn't work in the, it didn't work in the first time, one, the, what I was using was very cold, the egg was from the fridge, um, I mean there are many differences, but the whole idea at least is to, was to see if I can boil an egg in the microwave, and sure enough, yes you can so that's one other trick you can use when you are out there on the road get yourself some foil paper put your egg in the foil paper wrap it up and make sure that when you put it in water you submerge it at least put in a lot of water and then boil it personally i boiled this one for i think it was 15 minutes so just boil it for let's say 10 to 15 minutes just to make sure it's ready waves are here. I don't have any eggs. Thank you so much uh, Thomas 
for that uh, trick out there and if any of you has any other tricks that you think we can use to help other drivers out there on the road get a good delicious meal I'd like to hear of the recipes or the hacks and tricks so that I can be able to try them out all right guys until next time stay blessed and stay safe